Class 4, IMO Level 2. Mathematics question number 1. How many common factors do the numbers 40 and 90 have? The factors of 40 and 90 are listed. As we can see here, the common factors of 40 and 90 are 1, 2, 5 and 10. So, there are 4 common factors for the numbers. Mathematics question number 2. Which is the minimum number of squares that must be shaded so that the given figure has PQ as a line of symmetry? This part is symmetrical. This part is also symmetrical. This part is symmetrical. If we shade square 1, we'll get this part as symmetrical. If we shade square 2, we can get this part as symmetrical. If we shade square 3, then this part would be symmetrical. So, there are three minimum number of squares that must be shaded so that the given figure is has a line of symmetry. Mathematics question number three. Which of the following options represents the shaded part of the given figures? This, this figure is 3 by 4th fraction. This figure is 2 by 4. And this figure is 2 by 4. The C option represents this. Mathematics question number four. Select the correct option. A. The clock showing is 15 minutes past 8. No, it is showing 8.45, which is not 15 minutes past by 8. B. 20 minutes to 8. No, it is 7.20. And there is 40 minutes to 8. C. Quarter past 5. Yes, 5.15 is showing. That is the correct answer. Mathematics question number 5. In a school race, Aman ran 2 kilometers 50 meters. Gonjan ran 3 kilometers 150 meters. And Karthik ran 1 kilometer 540 meters. How much distance did they cover altogether? In order to find how much distance they covered altogether, we have to add distance covered by Aman, Gonjan and Karthik. In order to do this, we can see that the units are given as kilometer and meter. In order to add, we have to make sure that the unit is the same. So, we will convert all this to meters and then add. If we add, we will get 6740 meters, which can be written as 6 kilometers 740 meters. Mathematics question number 6. Find the perimeter of the shaded part of the given figure. As we can see, one square is 2 by 2 centimeters. First, we are going to see how many sides are there in the given figure. As we can see, there are 20 sides in the given figure. Length of one side is equal to 2 cm. Therefore, the perimeter is equal to 20 into 2, which is equal to 40 cm. Mathematics question number 7. Which of the following answer is correct? A option. A option is the wrong answer because the correct answer is 8014. B option is also not right. It is 21,450. C option is correct. It is 3104. So the answer is C. Mathematics question number 8. The given table shows the number of books donated by an NGO to needy children in 5 different months. Find the fraction of number of books donated in January and May together to the total number of books donated in all 5 months. Number of books donated in January and May is equal to 400 books. Total number of books donated in all 5 months is equal to 750. If we write this in fractional form, we will get 400 by 750. They have given the answer as equivalent fraction. So, we have to find the equivalent fraction of 400 by 750. Equivalent fraction of 400 by 750 is 8 by 15. Mathematics question number 9. How many of the following figures are closed? 1, 2, 3 and 4. There are 4 closed figures in this picture. Mathematics question number 10. Which of the following not be placed in the box to have the number in order from the greatest to least? We have to arrange this from greatest to least that is descending order. If we check D is the only option corresponding to this rule. Mathematics question number 11. Which of the following options shows the sum of these Roman numerals? CD is equal to 400, XL is equal to 40, and II is equal to 2, which leads us to 442. 
In the second numeral, CCC is equal to 300, LX is equal to 60, VI is, e is equal to 6, which leads us to 366. If we add these, we will get 808, which is equal to the C option. Math on this question number 12. Find the sum of place values and face values of digits at thousands place and tens place in the given number. The digit at the thousands place is 5 and its place value is 5000 and face value is 5. And in the tens place, we have 3. Its place value is 30 and face value is 3. So, the sum of the place values and face values is equal to 5038. Mathematics question number 13. The given graph shows the number of decorative items sold by 5 girls during the Div Diwali Mela in a school. Study the given graph carefully and answer the following questions. If each of the decorative items cost 125, then find the amount of money earned by Rashi. Now, we are going to see how many items Rashi sold. Rakshi sold 90 items. So, in order to find how much money earned by Rakshi, we have to multiply the number of items and the cost of one item, which is equal to 11,250. Find the difference between the number of items sold by Tanya and Kanya together and the number of items sold by Priya. Tanya is 60 and Kanya is 70 and Priya is 40. So, the number of items sold by Tanya and Kanya is equal to 130 and number of items sold by Priya is equal to 40. The difference between the number of items sold by Tanya and Kanya together and the number of items sold by Priya is equal to 130 minus 40 which is equal to 90. Mathematics question number 15. Sahil has a field of rectangle shape. The length of the field is twice its breadth. The breadth is 80 meters. Find the perimeter of the field. Given length is equal to 2B and B is equal to 80 meters. So L is equal to 160 meters and breadth is equal to 80 meters. So perimeter is equal to 2 into 160 plus 80 which is equal to 480 meters. That's it for this video. Make sure you subscribe. Hit that like button and turn on post navigation so that you guys never miss on a video that I upload. And I'll see y'all next time. Goodbye.